and I am back! Let's continue on with the story of Tales of Exilia. That captain needs to lay off a bit. Is he planning to grill us the entire voyage? If he has to, yes. He did sneak, up on, what do you sneak aboard his ship. We don't have any sort of identification. Speak for yourselves. Do you have identification, Alvin? I can't believe we're heading to Ajul. Look, we're leaving Fenmont Spirit Climb. That was interesting. Of course, leaving you the Spirit Climb. Old... Student. <laughs> Didn't expect that. Hey, can I ask you something? Why Depends on what it us? is. What's in it for you? Well, cash, of course. How does saving us make you money? Simple. I figure you must be in serious trouble if the military's after you. Now that I've swung to your rescue and impressed you with my daring do, I can charge you for my services. Yeah. Charge us what? I'm nearly broke. Same goes for me, I'm afraid. Sorry, Alvin. Seriously? I take more than just cash, you know. Don't you have any precious metals? Jewels? Rich relatives about to croak? Sure. Nothing on me. Everything happens so fast. I doubt I have anything that would sell for a high price either. What exactly do you do, Alvin? You look like a soldier, but you sure don't act like one. <laughs> You're on the right track, kid. I'm a mercenary. It's better than being a soldier. We don't have to follow orders. We set our own hours, and we help people. For a price. Well, it would seem like you helped us for free. Ah, uh, well, it's a risk of the trade. Maybe I'll find some paying customers in Anjou. Sorry about that. What else? Charity work. Wonderful. <sighs> Are we there yet? No. Are we there yet? No. Are we there yet? No. Are we there yet? No! God damn it, Apple. Now we're in Aju. Every time I, they say Aju, I keep thinking of like the sandwiches and the sauce. It doesn't help any. I think on paper it sounded pretty good, but when you say it, it's like. It's hard yes. to believe we're in a whole different country. Although it feels just like home. Hmm? Well, this part of Ajul is hardly what I'd call exotic. Huh. Hey, there's a map. Let me check it out for a bit. I'm the map! First, tell Jude he's got a... Go Great not kid. stalk Mila. Well, he plays it cool. Decided to make the best of it, has he? He's not as immature as he looks. Would it kill you to show a little concern? I mean, you dragged him into this, right? He insisted on helping me. I told him again and again to go home, but he wouldn't listen. He's here of his own accord. <laughs> I see. That's because you're pretty. He believes girl. he got himself into this mess, so now he has to put on a brave face. Either way. He's still acting like an adult. North of here. Hmm. So? You leaving now? No. Alvin, you must be well versed with a sword. Mercenaries like you must have some battle chops. Well, yeah, of course. Could you teach me how to use one? I don't have the four to back me up anymore. If I can't wield a sword, what's left? The four? Not sure I follow. But I'd be more than happy to teach you, if only you had some cash. So you won't help? Here, how about we make some moolah while I train you? What do you mean? Well... Side questing! There's got to be some paying customers here in the Sea Haven, right? Let's take a look around.
A sub-event occurs when you speak with a character marked with an exclamation mark on their, above their head. Complete sub-events to receive gold and items. Seek these people out whatever, or whenever you arrive in town. God, it's hard for me to read it. I wish I can read normally, but I'm blind. This was surging with mana when they activated their so-called Lance of Kresnik. So this must be the key they used to arm it. Do you want something? Whoa, hold your fire. I come in peace. Can't a mercenary have a friendly chat with his clients? No. That much is fine. But when you want to chat, you needn't hold your breath and sneak up behind me. Sheesh. You make me sound so unsavory. Do you berate poor Jude like this too? I don't intend to berate anyone. That was never my intention. Do try to be gentle with him. Boys can be so vulnerable. That's a surprisingly tender sentiment. That's what it says on my business card. The mercenary with a heart of gold. Those no, are good doesn't. words to live by. Although, with a motto like that, I can't imagine you'd live very long. <laughs> Not the type to sugarcoat things, are you? Alright, so this is actually required to do a sub-event, but here's our first sub event uh i'll go on ahead and do a couple more maybe i'm not sure yet when or where i will do that but yeah let's go on ahead and do our sub event a required hey there sub -event. you've got a request right how about letting us handle it oh you're mercenaries oh perfect timing what kind of request well, someone's got a problem with monsters and we get paid to solve their problem Oh, so by taking on these jobs, you get the reward, and I get the practice. Bingo! Right! Everybody wins. Well, except the monsters. Okay, hit us with the details. Some monsters we've never seen before are lurking near a lake west of the Sea Haven. A lot of people depend on that lake for water, so those monsters have become a real nuisance. I'm looking for someone to exterminate the beasts. What's the reward? Cash, of course. You heard the woman. Thoughts? Sounds fine to me. Fighting monsters will be good training. Excellent. Now these beasts are no pushovers, so please watch yourselves. Will do. Now, can I level Alvin? I kind of want to get that done. About your sword training. The monsters aren't just going to stand there like training dummies, you know? We should go over some basics first. I appreciate it. Uh, can I just skip this part? Ready your sword. Oh. Okay. Well, that'll do. That works. You have my gratitude. Shall we go? Wait, Jude. Take a moment to consider your situation. You don't have to stay with me anymore, you know. Uh, right. Now that we've crossed the border, it'll be a while before any pursuers from Rashugal get here. What are you suggesting? Just that he still has some time to think things over. Sorry. I'll make up my mind by the time you set off. Okay, very well. Let's go and complete that request. You thought you were doing the right thing. Now you're on the run. That's a pretty tough lesson for a kid your age. Yeah, but I brought it upon myself. All right. So do I need to go back to her? No, nope. okay, so it's already started up. We're gonna go on ahead and head to those monsters. Get that done. Hi, monsters. I'm gonna kill you now. Hmm. My lilium orb is shining. Mine too. Wait, you two have orbs too? Great! We should try linked combat. What's that? Lilium orbs are handy things. They let you sense your companion's intent. That's a huge advantage in battle. 
You can coordinate your thoughts to pull off combination attacks. We call this linking. Sounds great, but how do we do it? Try it and see for yourself. Focus your consciousness into the Lilium Orb. Now, I'm going to skip the tutorial because all you need to do is push the directional button and you kind of do whatever. Victory born from cooperation and friendship. Not bad, right? Yes, I quite like it. I feel much better knowing I'm not fighting alone. <laughs> right there with you, buddy. All right. So that's out of the way. I should do Alvin's Lily Morb. Oh, God, as much as I don't want to. Screw it. Yes, yeah, I'll level. Yes, auto level again. Try to get as quickly done as I can so that I'm not stuck here for 10 15 minutes trying to get his orb done. Uh, yeah. Let's try to get everything even out real quick, if I can. Anyways, uh, I actually got to see Lord of the... Or not Lord of the Rings, but The Hobbit! Ah, uh, that's what I meant to say, The Hobbit. And... From what I've seen, the, the I've seen the first movie and I've seen this brand new one, the third movie. I've not seen the second one, but um, if memory serves me right, with the cartoon movie, um, yeah, it's interesting. Um, I can't help but kind of compare the cartoon movie with the um, with the live action movies. It's kind of a habit, just like, uh, when, like, comparing a sequel to the originals. Okay, that's pretty good right there. Go back and at least fill up some of these, uh, level one orbs. Um, did I think it was a good movie? I thought it was pretty good. Did I think it was an awesome movie and, like, amazing? No, not at all. Um, part of the reason why is because... I don't know, I felt like it's kind of... I have my complaints with this one, as I have my complaints with the first... Oops, went the wrong way! I have my complaints with the third Hobbit movie that I have my complaints with the first. You can clearly tell what is filler and what is not. Here we go again. Well done, Alvin. All in the line of duty. Naturally. Or I'll have you fired. Whoa, hey now. That's always funny to have them together. Hey, Alvin, about your weapon. You've got an eye for good steel. This is one heck of a blade. Actually, I meant the other one. Oh, you mean this? Yeah, I've never seen anything like it. It looks like it channels fire spirits and projects their arts at foes. Yeah, something like that. That's incredible. Where'd you get it? Oh, I see how it is. You're the envious type. Stare all you want, kid. I ain't giving it up. You don't have to treat me like a child. Oh, come on. I'm just yanking your chain. Hey, where'd the honor student go? Looking for me? Uh, how'd you get behind me? <laughs> so even a mercenary can get taken by surprise. Ah, uh, didn't your mom teach you it isn't polite to sneak up on people? It's like you vanished without a trace. Did I? I just move in opposition to my foe and then circle around them. Like this. I ain't falling for that twice, kid. Huh? Where'd he go? Over here. Oh, how did you get there? <laughs> So even the Lord of Spirits can get taken by surprise. 
That's impressive, but really unnerving. Yeah. It's especially creepy when you pull that move on a female opponent. Creepy? Hey! My special ability isn't creepy. <laughs> oh! Boss me up! Eh, same concept right there. Moved off position to my opponent. <laughs> hmm. Should've gone a little easier. Now I'm hoping with this run through of the game, it will be a little bit faster. No time for a break. All right. You know, I think there used to be a town around here. Want to take a peek? But we haven't completed our job yet. Come on, school's out. Your homework doesn't have a due date anymore. When you accept the request, you can take it at your own pace. Is that the way it works? That's the way it works. The whole reason you took the request was to pay my fee, right? If you see another opportunity to make a few bucks, feel free to make that the priority. I had been planning to get you paid in Niakara. That's so? Well, you're the client. At the end of the day, it's your call. All right. That... I did not push any buttons for her. That was actually automatic. Come on. Come on. Please take it. Thank you. Feels a little weird actually controlling the camera because I've been playing Graces lately. And with Graces, you don't get to control the camera. It's just uh, kind of there. Okay, that's down and out. Let's see if we can get a skit or something. Anything popping up. Nope, okay. So we're gonna go the other way then, at least to the watering hole. Oh, hello. Let's see. What are you up to? Just trying Stuff. to organize all of my notes for my thesis. Those in the books at a time like this? You sure are studious. Yeah, probably a waste of time. I'm sure I've already been expelled being an X-marked criminal and all. Ah, cheer up, kid. If I get a chance, I'll testify to the military and the school on your behalf. Shouldn't be hard to make the case that you're just a poor kid who got sucked into this. Thanks. But aren't you a wanted criminal too? Ah, that. I guess I did flee along with you. So if we get captured, I'll testify for you. I'll tell them that you're nowhere near as shady as you look. <laughs> I'll take it as a compliment. These kids can be actually be pretty lighthearted, especially with uh, the ones with uh, Jude and Alvin. Which makes me a little sad. There's a couple of things that make me sad about not playing as Jude in this playthrough. Because of... I don't get the option to fight Alvin later on. I, I can't really explain why you fight Alvin right now, but it makes... Oh god. But it, it kind of makes sense. Far too easy. Alright, let's see this. That, and let's kill these monsters. Let's see, it's trying to kind of... No, 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 no. I'm trying to kind of grind her a little bit too, to make sure that I have enough well done, XP for a ball in the fights. Because these boss fights are going to be the death of me if I'm not careful. Of course, I have a while before a dangerous boss fight comes around, but... Still, a boss fight is a boss fight is a boss fight. Here we go! Here we go! My sword rings true. Oh shit, I just remembered. I need to go to my skills instead of my skills. Okay, I have 130, so you know, we're gonna up my vitality, strength, agility, intelligence. Basically all the uh, important stuff. Um, okay, I wish I could see. Ooh, guard him in there, that's not, that's not bad. Guard against uh, that damage. Decrease damage from guarding. Oops. Nice. Get that taken care of too. The assaults. 
that. Uh, a boy staggering while spirits shifting back to a regular spirit art. Complete restores HP. That's kind of nice, but that. Um, it's not bad. Charm an enemy. I think, I think charming's R3. I can't remember what charming is. Yep, I am really early in game right now. But, um, uh, this is a new game plus. So I am using grades to just kind of put me through, push me through as fast as I can. But hopefully without the dying. Um, aerial jump, aerial dash, max step voltage. Um, That's kind of nice. Um, let's do that. Okay. There we go. That looks pretty good for the most part. Immunity. Name singles for Alvin! Yay! Chivalry. Okay. It's good enough for now, I guess. You're starting to look pretty good with that blade. Hmm. I do seem to possess an aptitude for sword fighting. Um, what I hope to accomplish? Well, I kind of want to get through Mila's storyline. I've never beaten Mila's storyline. So, and I've owned this game since day one, but I finally am starting to play it. Kind of sad when, I sound, when it sounds like that. Um, plus, you know, just want to go through and... Try to be, make this as painless as possible to go through the game, to be honest. Okay, I cannot remember where the hell I was going. I went backwards. Kind of doing the same thing right now with uh, Tales of Graces F. I'm actually live streaming that one too with a new game plus. No! Oh! There you go. Especially since Tales of Graces F, um, a lot of people may not like it when I say it, but it's actually one of my favorite ones, if not my favorite Tales game. And a lot of people may also disagree, but uh, The Abyss is my least favorite that I've really, really played through. Nope. Come on, there we go. Trying to attack him from behind, making my job a little bit easier. Over already? Oh, I think about it. Do I have my art set up? Um, let's do some tech arts. Well done, Alvin. All in the line of duty. Naturally. That's good to know that I'm not the only one who hasn't uh, beaten both storylines right off the bat. Um, I've played Tales of the Abyss, Tales of Racist F, Tales of Legendia. Um, uh, Tales of Symphonia. I had to think about that one for a second. Uh, Tales of Symphonia 2, I can't remember what the subtitle for it is for some reason. Cool. <laughs> Even though Why I have a collection and it's right next to me. My sword rings true. It is... Which one is it? Dawn of the New World. That's how much of an impact that game had on me. Very little. Um, oh! Let's grab this. 
there. I think I might be able. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't attack me yet, Wolfie. I'm gonna grab the spider web. No breaks? Um, I wanna play Fantasia. I still have yet to play that one as much as I would like to play it. I have an emulator, so I don't know why I don't play it. Thinking about it now. He's next. Well done, Alvin. Oh, no. Mm. Okay, there's a treasure chest. Spiderwebs. I do not know what spiderwebs are going to do for me, but oh well. So, uh, for you, Meow, what, uh, Tales games have you played? Oh, nope, didn't catch me. No time for Over already? we're supposed to get rid of. Indeed. They certainly don't look like the normal fauna for this area. All right. Let's get the job done. Oh, no. I didn't want to do the linking. Okay. Fine. Fine. <laughs> Got it. Aha, okay, that's how it's done. Um, can I can I get out of this tutorial now? The likes of you will not stop me. Oh, that's right. I also have Tales of Hearts R. For some odd reason I didn't remember that one. Of course I haven't played it in a while. You okay? I can't complain. No better training than an actual battle. You got that right. Let's head back to Alati Sea Haven and make a report. I have played a little bit of Vesperia, though. Just, uh... It was actually kind of funny. A friend of mine could not beat one of the bosses. He was just getting his ass handed to him in the best period. He's like, here, Scotty, I need you to play this game. I'm like, okay, I'll help you with the boss fight. Game second controller, we just annihilated it. I mean, just a rape the boss like it was nothing. Really, what's the best way to uh, set, ta set the tactics, in your opinion? Because I don't you normally set the tactics too much. But you're the first person to actually mention uh, tactics well done, in any All Tales in game. Duty. Naturally, or I'll have you fired. Whoa, hey now. Here I can grab. I don't want to miss anything either. That's another thing I want to set up for Exilia, or try to get is uh, I want to try to find everything this time so I don't miss anything. I know I missed some of the. Uh, sub events from before. I'm hoping not to miss it. My sword rings true. I miss sub events and I miss skits. So I'm trying to avoid that this time. Yes, come and get me. Oh, missed. Next. 
Over already? All right, let's let's go on ahead and head back to a lobby Sea Haven. Huh? Have to really uh, look at the strat. I just went backwards. I was looking at the chat and I went backwards. Okay. Um, I'll make sure the next time I actually pick up the game. I'll go on ahead and see if I can change the uh, tactics and see how well I can survive in that game. Okay, so it's this way I gotta go. Stay focused. I can't remember which boss it was. Um, it was such a long time ago, too, that he had me help him. I just gotten done playing Exilia when it first came out when he was playing uh, Vesperia. No I think it was a big boss though. I can't remember yeah. any of the bosses. So I think true. it was a bigger boss. If that helps any. Kill the monsters, kill the monsters, Here you're dead. Oh, oh, right. oh yeah! Well done, Alvin. All in the line of duty. Naturally. Or I'll have you fired. Whoa. I kind of like those uh, special uh, battle endings. Okay, let's see if I can try taunting. Nope, I don't know how to taunt. <laughs> All right. My sword rings true. Funny thing is, I don't own Vesperia, but I own the movie for it, though. Thinking about it, um, I actually really like the movie. Now, I know Funimation picked up Tales of... Um, what was it? They picked up, I think, Fantasia, and they picked up Tales of... The Abyss, the anime. I couldn't remember the name of it for some reason. I, haven't, I guess because I'm, it's so late and I'm getting tired, but I'm trying Those to get as much as I can. Those monsters won't be tinkling in your water supply anymore. Wonderful. Thank you for your help. And that's how it's done. More where that came from, too. Lots of people with problems out there, and gall to make them go away. You're a real pro at this, Alvin. Hmm. No fever. How are you feeling? I don't seem to have any strength. Um, have you been eating properly? I've never eaten. Ever? Through Sylph, I drew life from the air. With Undine's power, I received sustenance from the water. What's she talking about? I guess the spirits gave her all the energy she needed. Well... Now you're gonna have to nourish yourself the old-fashioned way. I see. So this is what you call hunger. <laughs> Fascinating. So, should we rest at the inn? Now that you mention it, I could use some grub myself. Auto item system has been unlocked. I'll go on ahead and at least... Nope, never mind. I was gonna say I'll start on the other events, but never mind. I'll just wait until this next part. That's pretty nifty, though. If the skits are actually pretty good length. Um... I'm assuming the skits are actually pretty entertaining to watch, too. Welcome. Three rooms, please. But before that, can we get something to eat? Oh, my apologies, but our cook isn't in yet. Hey, is she okay?
Can we at least use your kitchen? Yes, please. Help yourself. Your friend looks like she's about to pass out. M my stomach? It really is growling. <laughs> and here I thought that was just a silly human expression. <laughs> that would be awesome to actually see that in a skit. I really like tail skits because they can be really, really lighthearted. And not always serious, which is nice. Hey, not Ow. bad. Not bad. It's good. I quite enjoy ingesting calories with you. Humans should learn to cherish these simple pleasures. Yay? Really weird when she says it like that. Good morning, Alvin. Sorry you had to carry me up there. Don't worry about it. Just part of the job. Oh? <laughs> so now what are you gonna do? Well... Good morning. Good day, Hi, Jude. Jude. I was just about to share my plans with Alvin. What is it? I'm thinking of returning to Nia Kara. Is that your hometown? More accurately, it's where my shrine is. If I go back, I might be able to resummon the four. So, she really is Maxwell. This is where you come in, Jude. Will you accompany me to Nia Kara? What? It's true that you brought your current situation upon yourself, but I bear some of the blame as well. I'll put in a good word for you with the people of Nia Kara. I'm sure they'll look after you. Wow, you've put a lot of thought into this. Yes. Remember when you told me I seemed unconcerned? I decided to take that to heart. Mila, you don't need to practice your swordplay anymore? No need to concern yourself with my martial abilities. Well, if nothing else, you know how to swing the pointy end. As a start. Okay. I'll come with you. Good. Oh, God. You needn't worry. A little more practice wouldn't hurt, though. You think so? Well, better safe at than least sorry. didn't steal it. Come find me once you're ready to go. Wait, you're coming with us, Alvin? Why not? I've come this far. Hey, Mila? Hmm? Thanks. And it's raining here. Here comes the rain again. Falling on my head like a memory. Falling on my head like a new emotion. Alright, going ahead and save real quick. There we go. There's been quite a few times I was actually tempted to just buy the uh, Japanese version and be like, see, I own this period now and just play it in Japanese. And just tell everyone, I can le le legitimately do this because I am Japanese. So, there. Ha game. And everyone else. Ha. Ha. And then everyone would just remind me I'm only half Japanese. Ready to hit the road? Mila, you said it's north of here? How far? Less than half a day's flight time. If we could fly using Sylph's power. Oh, well, I'm afraid my wings are, you know, non existent. I hope we can find a place to rest along the way. The map showed a village in that direction, so we should be okay. Either way, we can't just stay here. We must press forward. I know, I know. All right, all right. I'll try to get this period when I get the chance. Maybe that at an anime expo. If I finally get to so go. Seriously, 
You guys are spying for Ajul, right? What? Of course not. I've never heard of the Military Powers Act being used against anyone other than Ajul spies. You're thinking too much into this. Why are you so concerned about this? Unless you're spying for Rashagol. No, no. I was just thinking that if you were spying for Ajul, maybe you could use your connections to score me some high-paying intelligence work. Sorry to disappoint you, but I assure you I will pay your fee. You just have to wait a little bit longer. Fair enough. But even with your special friend discount, the interest is piling up. Oh, be quiet, Alvin. Is Milo really that Maxwell? She does act a bit nutty, but she looks normal enough. I think it's true. When I first met her, Mila had the four great spirits with her. What? Get out of here. No, seriously. Fire spirit Efreet, water spirit Undine, wind spirit Sylph, and earth spirit Gnome. It was the first time I'd ever seen them in person, but there was no mistaking who they were. That's a mighty exclusive club. Can't imagine they hang out with a lot of mortal girls. Yeah. Can I talk now, game? Can I? Thank you. No, I am not Californian. I am Oregonian. So I'm actually right above California. Is it hard to hear me? Alright, let's drop the game audio down a little bit. Am I, uh... Am I hearable enough? The sea I'm not sure. Me feel unpleasant. I did drop the uh, volume of the game a little bit. Hopefully you can hear me a little better now. I just don't want to peek my microphone. That's the hard thing to do. Going ahead and get some sub events going as we speak. Yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah, accept it. I know. We gotta do the same thing again. Just go to the water pond. Anyone else need help here? Nope. Any shinies? Nope. Okay, cool. Hearable enough is better than not hearable at all. Oh, there you are. I know you wanted something, too. Uh... Okay... Do I have anything to make what he wanted? Uh... I am... Pretty far behind on that one. Okay. Is that... I think that might be it for that. Is that it? Is that it? Yep. Go on ahead and quickly get one of the side quests slash sub events done. Always Oops. with the skits. Gotta straighten my scarf. You sure do love that thing. Don't you? It's one of Fismage's finest. Custom made for yours truly. I don't know much about brands, but it does look good on you. You gotta be careful about what you wear, kid. It's how the world judges a man. I'd rather think what's inside is what counts. Yeah, and this is how what's inside gets projected to the outside. You don't believe some people shape what's outside in order to conceal the ugliness within? <laughs> well, if you can't see through a false front, isn't that your problem? So you blame the victims for being deceived. If that's really what you believe, Alvin, it tells me all I need to know about what's within. Man, <laughs> I sure slipped up this time, huh? Oh god! That scared me a little bit. You are such fools. <laughs> Why do you Alright! Alright! Super hyped, huh? Let's push through. Speaking of hype, well done, Alvin. All no. The Tales of Dasteria anime should be coming on here, like in a matter of days, I think. No. 
nope, no, no, no special abilities for you. Bad monkey. So I gotta go this way. Ah, oh, okay. Walking sure is grueling. That's unexpected coming from you. I'm just used to having Sylph fly me everywhere. The only time I ever really walked was when I used Undine to travel across water. I see. Maybe this is your punishment for treating the four great spirits like your personal servants? Servants? They may help out now and then, but they're the ones who pester me. They're like a bunch of bickering in-laws that never go home. Did you just call the four bickering in-laws? Yes. Yes, you did. I don't know what to think of that either, guys. Uh, that would have been... Yeah. And we'll also call you free to bickering in-law. i like, please don't hurt me. I don't want to die. I'm too pretty to die. I need to stop going the wrong way. Ugh, there we go. Okay, so it is this way. I'm not going crazy. I swear I am going crazy. Of course it doesn't help. I am pretty blind without gla glasses. So. Compared to Fenmont's night climb, the sky in Anjul sure is bright. That's true. The spirit climbs here are much more stable. What are you talking about? What do you intend to climb? C-L-I-M-E. Surely the great Lady Maxwell knows all about the subject? Don't flatter yourself by assuming I recognize every arbitrary word you humans create. Human arrogance can be so trying. Mila, do you know what Riza Maxi is made of? As if I wouldn't know? The power of spirits composes the entire natural world. Right. The term spirit climb refers to the balance of spirit power. When that power is out of balance, nature can become polarized in one direction. That's why there are unusual spirit climbs, like the perpetual night of Fenmont. I see. Thank you. Now I understand. You're very good at explaining things. My pleasure. Oh, I see how it is. I guess I'm just an arrogant human compared to little old innocent Jude. Yay, glasses! I gotta get them fixed. Far too easy. Hopefully I can get them fixed uh, probably in the next few days. Uh, it's gonna have to be, you know, hope, sadly from a jeweler and my prescription's about seven years old, but, you know, what's the worst gonna happen? At least they're not titanium glasses. Because, yeah, I had titanium glasses and I broke them. Nope, you're not. Oh, I don't know. I'll, I'll, I'll fight you, monster. If you want to really want to fight me, we can, I can kill you now. Here we go. No breaks. Isn't it a bit, well, too short? Uh, no, isn't that great? And unrestricted. I guess so. <laughs> Oh, game. You do have charm. And it's time to kill you all. You can die now, bird. You can die now, bird. And you can just die, too. There we go. Thanks. A little longer and I would have been dinner. You guys look like you know how to fight. Just don't let your guard down like I did. No, I was cleaning the fra the frames the uh, lenses one time and the frames just broke. That's the weird thing. Far too easy. Almost leveled! Watch out! Here we go! Right. Oh, my sword rings true. 
All right, monkey. There you are, monkey. Well done, Alvin. All in the line of duty. Naturally. It's kind of sad, but yes, I... I, I don't know how I break titanium glasses, but it's just kind of happened. No, I don't do anything. I just wear my glasses like normal, and they broke. Maybe me sleeping in my glasses might have something to do with them. Like, a couple times I was just be laying there or sitting there and I fall asleep and the next thing you know my glasses are off my face. Or when I wake up from my from the unexpected nap, it's like, oh, I have my glasses on. Where are they on? No time for a break. Over already? And I'm close to leveling. I'm getting a lot of jet black feathers, which is kind of good because I need them. Out of our way. You owe me. My sword rings true. Aha! So I'm level. Burp, huh? Set now. Set now. Well done. Well, uh, excuse you, I guess? I don't know how to say it to a burp. Doopy doop 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 doop. Might as well just. Uh, I'll do a couple more monsters so that way I can kind of get that done. Get them leveled, at least one level. Don't get killed. Here we go. Alright! Just keeps getting... There we go. Let's get the Lydium Orbs leveled up. Yeah, there is. Um, I think. Just gotta do this real quick. See if I can remember how to do it. There we go. She's now done. Completely and utterly done. Okay, he's and voila. Now, if I recall, uh. Oops, uh, I think it's that. Yep. Makes me feel a little better actually running around as Jude. But then once I go in the battle, I'm going to realize right away that I am not Jude, I am Mila. We're going to run around as Alvin. Because Alvin's awesome. Or for those who like uh, fan service... There's always the camera angles with Mila. Go ahead and save. I don't know why I need to save because it's kind of pointless right now because I'm right next to town. We support. Yeah, triangle to switch characters. You just have to. Um, when you're in the menu, go to them. Highlight them, and whatever character you want to have be leader. So when you run around, bam. You rescued her. Thank you. You're welcome. I now have God. Alright, I think this is where I'm going to end the live stream tonight. Thank you for joining in. If you enjoy my uh, 
If you enjoyed this live stream, go on ahead and follow me here on twitch.tv. Or if you want to stay up to date, go on ahead and follow me on Twitter at scottuncle1. Or if you want to uh, see my other Let's Plays, you can go on ahead and, fo and follow. Subscribe to me on youtube.com. I'll leave a link right here. youtube.com slash user slash official. Thank you all for tuning in, and until next time, which will probably be tomorrow, uh, catch you later. And you're quite welcome.